Hey, what's up, everybody? It's Sam here from the Sam Welby 12 Experience. Welcome to our Eastern Conference Playoff Review. That way, we're starting over here on my left. We are going to get going with the Eastern Conference predictions, and we're going to kick it off down below to start with the Carolina Hurricanes and the New York Islanders. These two teams had an even regular season series. They were tied two games apiece, 2-2. Canes and Islanders, and the Islanders have been hot rolling into these playoffs. However, the buck stops here. The the Canes are just so good that I think the Canes are taking this one in five. Sorry, Islanders. Would love to see an upset here, but I think Carolina has your number in five games. If we go up one notch, the New York Rangers, the Washington Capitals, this series is going to be a hard-hitting series. The Capitals just making it in, squeaking in that last wild card. Thanks, Tortorella, for pulling your goaltender with three minutes left in regulation of a tied game, allowing Washington to squeak in, knocking out the Red Wings, knocking out the Penguins. The Caps, they're in here. And again, the Rangers-Capitals in the regular season, they were split. Two games apiece, 2-2. Two, two. However, this one, no dice. The New York Rangers are going to steamroll the Washington Capitals. And again, I think this could be another five-game series. Six, if the Rangers want to be nice and uh, give the Capitals a bit of a chance. But I think the New York Rangers are going to take this one home. If we move to the top of the board, Florida-Tampa Bay. This is going to be a fun, fun series Battle of the state. Who's going to come out on top? The Florida Panthers, the Tampa Bay Lightning. The Panthers took this one 2-1. Two to one. The Panthers have had a much better season. This is going to come down to goaltending. We know Vasilevsky's going to be Vasilevsky-like. He's going to be outstanding. Boborowski's going to have to stand on his head. There's been a lot of changes to both these teams. And I think at the end of the day, the Florida Panthers are going to take this in six Games. I think it's going to be a six-game series with the Panthers coming out on top. Now, the series a lot of people are talking about, Boston, Toronto. This one was one where it wasn't set until the second last day of the season. Toronto was facing Florida for a long time. Boston with a loss to Ottawa and Florida with a win over Toronto. Flip-flop these series, and now we have the big rematch that everyone's looking forward to, Toronto and Boston. Now, Boston... Gave it to Toronto all season long. Boston won all four games. Mind you, two of them went to overtime or shootouts, but Boston won all four. Now, I think things are going to change here in the playoffs. Their records were super, super close. 47 wins for Boston, 46 wins for Toronto. Boston has the better goalie tandem. Boston's defense is a little better, but I give the offense to Toronto, and I think Toronto is built to handle the toughness of the Bruins. They've shown it. Domi getting gritty. Bertuzzi getting gritty. Reeves stepping up. Health is going to be a big factor here. Is Domi healthy? Is McMahon healthy? How long can these guys last? Will Willie and Nylander float around? I hope not. But I'm going to go out on a limb here, and I'm going to give the edge to Toronto in seven games. I think this is going to be a seven-game series, and I know... I know everyone's saying, Sam, you're nuts. Boston is going to take it. I'm, I'm thinking, no, I'm giving it to Toronto. The odds makers have it pegged 53% for Boston, 47% for Toronto. That's so close to that percentage within the error margin. So I'm going for the Maple Leafs. Maple Leafs in seven. It's going to be a good one. Thanks for watching. Let me know your predictions in the chat. We're going to come back with the West Coast predictions very, very soon. So thank you. We'll see you. All your coverage, by the way, we have Leafs games. We have Panther games. We're going to cover the Rangers. We're going to have all your NHL action right here on the channel. So make sure that you have subscribed. Thanks for watching. We'll see you real soon. And I can't wait. Let's get this playoffs going.